Oh, good morning, Kevin and Casey. Um, how are y'all doing? I um, just arrived and opened up 1816. Um, I can't get the light on in the in the foyer here. Um, but anyway, we'll just go through it. Um, the pictures online looked really beautiful. Um, there are some, I think that people live here or they're, or they're just here. So, um, you'll see, you know, kind of looks like people live here. So just so you're aware, um, there's a great, you're on the third floor here. You're uh, on the corner and you, you overlook the, the Marina village over there. So that's kind of cute. I really like that, that's fun, you know? I hope y'all can hear me with this mask on. I feel like I'm shouting. Anyway, um, just, um, I should have opened the, I don't know if you can see there, but that's your view out to the parking lot and the other bluff villas. The kitchen looks fantastic. It has been redone. Um, so it's new cabinetry, new counters. Um, I can look on the, the, uh, the listing document to see what year they did this, but um, that's, it. that's in good shape. That looks great. Oops, oops, okay. I don't know why I can't get the hallway light on. Um, that's my image in the mirror there. Please don't look at the way I'm dressed. I had to go to the dump this morning, so I just have on jeans. Not looking very professional today. Um, but this is the hallway closet. You know, these are all the same. Um, sometimes the hall closet is locked because the owners use them and they're locked. So the last one I showed you, I don't think I could get into this, but um, that shows you, you know, what extra storage space you have there. And then um, the air handler here. Oh, and then you've got a little, oh, and the water heater too. So, and you've got a little extra storage there as well. Bathroom looks nice and has been redone as well from its original state. Uh, this looks to be the original tub, or shower, excuse me, shower tub, whatever. Newer, um, that's a newer shower head. And then they put in the cool, like, uh, round, rounded um, shower bar. This one is um, being sold furnished as uh, the listing documents described. Uh, none of the light switches work. So this is the master bedroom. Um, into the master bath here. Again, um, this was redone even better. Nice new lighting fixtures. And I know you're wondering why I'm pointing the camera at the ceiling. I was just looking to see, I always look to see if there's any water damage of any kind. Of course, those kinds of things come out in the inspection. The shower stall here is looks to be also original, but again, they installed a really cool shower head. I hope you can hear me. So this one is redone even 
better, I think, than the other one. Hence the 459. Here's your view out to the front parking lot. That's my car right there. And you're just looking out over the other units, the other bluff units. These folks uh, didn't put the bed back together, I guess, when they got out of it today. Here's your closet. Got ample, ample storage. Turn those lights back off. And we'll go into the second bedroom. Well, I'm having such a hard time with lights. I hope you can see um, the light switches aren't working or maybe they're set up. This piece of furniture here is a uh, vintage early American Hilton head. I used to have that same um, dresser in my bedroom growing up. It's that fake rattan or whatever. Opening the window here is again, same view from the master. The master and the second bedrooms in these are right next to each other. Um, again, there's your retro. Gee, I had this furniture. I had this exact same furniture. This is crazy. Um, the washer dryer here is installed in the second closet, second bedroom closet. And um, the showing this morning didn't prompt these people to actually do their laundry or get it up off the floor, but that's okay. I can see around it. Um, yeah. So you probably want to know what my thoughts are. Um, I give it a thumbs up. I think it's good. I, th I think the, um, you know, for, for what your intended use is, um, it's probably good to go. Maybe change out, uh, that, second bedroom furniture the carpets it seems to be in good shape for for what you're going for um you could of course if you really wanted to tear the carpet up and put down hardwood or that l not hardwood but the lvp the the luxury vinyl plank which um everybody's doing especially in the rental market it's a very durable product and doesn't scratch easily and whatnot so um Anyway, I uh, am going to get back to my office and the Wi-Fi so I can upload this video to uh, YouTube and I'm going to actually film uh, my way out so you have a better understanding of how the building works. There are three floors to each building. They all have, each floor has four units. Um, there are no elevators here in these condos, just stairs. That's uh, because we want you to be healthy and in shape. So every floor is exactly the same. Those people have a nice decorative thing outside their door. When you come down, the second floor is actually goes out to the parking lot. And then you've got um, four more units down. That's those stairs. So then we come out here. I'm going to turn the camera around so you can see the front facade of the building. There are, let me think, one, two, maybe six buildings that comprise Bluff Villas. And then each building has 12 units per building. No, 24, excuse me, 24. But that's what um, the front of your building looks like. And they're all exactly the same. 
all exactly the same. These are super great. Uh, they rent well. I had some of these I think I mentioned when I owned my cleaning business and we were down here cleaning these all the time. South Beach is a popular destination. It's just like Harbor Town or any of the iconic places in Hilton Head where people love to come. Rents well right next to the Marina Village as you know right across the street from the the beach access to South Beach and um, yeah so um, let me get this uploaded and I will uh, send it to you and then if you have any questions you can let me know thanks bye